Question 11. Saren has a fair eight-sided spinner. The sections of the spinner are numbered 1, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3, 4, 4. So this is a probability question now. Um, probability is written as the total outcomes on the bottom of the fraction and successful outcomes on the top. So in this case, how many uh, total possibilities do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, says in the question. So then each one would say how many of each number are there. So for example, which number is the spinner most likely to land on? So which number comes up the most often? So there would be three threes out of eight. The fours would be two out of eight. The ones would be one out of eight. And the twos would be two out of eight. So the three is most likely to come up. And that would be one mark. Circle one term from the list below that describes the probability of the spinner landing on a two. So the probability that it lands on a two, there are two twos out of a total eight numbers. So if it was impossible, it would be zero out of eight. It would never happen. If it was certain, it would be 8 out of 8, every number would be a 2. If it was even, that would be half and half, so it would be 4 out of 8. But there are two 2s out of the total 8. So it's definitely not even, it's not impossible. The best word to describe the chance of picking a 2 would be unlikely. For one mark. On the probability scale, below mark with an arrow the probability of the spinner landing on a three so we said the probability of it landing on a three was three out of eight again at zero it would be zero out of eight at one it would be eight out of eight so this probability line is split up into eight um, options here so that would be four out of eight so if this this is halfway that would be four this would be 2, and this would be 6 out of 8. So my 3 out of 8 is going to come exactly halfway in between these two. So I'm just going to show with an arrow the probability of the spinner landing on a 3. That would be here, and that would be one mark.